Hey, we're doing. Hey, everybody. We it's been a while since we did a video with uh, vinyl plank over tile. So here's a new house that uh, my buddy's doing a reno in. We're taking the vinyl plank directly over the tile. No subfloor. Not even an underlayment with this. So we're gonna try this floor without an underlayment or a subfloor. Here's the. Uh, I'm giving you some pictures here to tell it, give you the dimensions and the uh, specs on the uh, the flooring that we're using in here. And as you can see, it's just a, a cork floor, vinyl plank with cork. Uh, it's supposed to be waterproofing, so we'll see how that goes. But uh, it's going directly over tile. Um, I did another video of my house that uh, we just went directly over tile. We used the underlayment with it, and it wasn't a cork floor. It was uh, just a vinyl plank. With no core. This is uh, this stuff's called new core flooring. I'm not a commercial or anything. Yeah, so might as well do a video. I'm not advertising video. it. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to let you know how this uh, holds up. Um, going directly over tile. Uh, the other vinyl plank that I used in my other video held up really well. Um, so we're just hoping that this one does too. And, and the way it's being laid in right now, when it's going down, it's feeling really. You're not feeling any of the the bumps or the tiles. And you see this is cork here. You're not feeling any of the bumps of the tile. It feels really smooth. It actually feels better than the uh, vinyl plank that I put into my house, which was uh, not core, or the cork. But uh, um, this is uh, really easy to lay. It hasn't been too hard. You know, some cuts are a little difficult to make for a newbie. But, uh. And in this room, there was such a step down that they had to put a concrete board uh, to kind of even up to the tile. It still didn't totally make it to the tile. So as you see in that picture, they used uh, they just used the cardboard from the boxes, and they kind of transitioned it down into a nice uh, slope to keep it a nice smooth transition. It came out really well. If you go back to that picture, and the whole floor is coming out really well right now. And I just wanted to uh, do another video of the vinyl plank right over tile because the last one that I made was about two years ago, and. Uh, in that are my house and I'm gonna I'll put up another video of how it looks after two years and that's uh, directly over tile uh, this vinyl plank wood is amazing it's cool it's great and you know everybody wants to charge so much money to put a subfloor and underling it down that nah, you know welcome to 2019 you might not have to do that anymore but like I said I'll keep you posted and, and see, make sure that it does turn out you know satisfied to uh, to be able to, to continue to do this, it's great. Thanks.